Hello, today we embark on an exciting journey back in time to explore the series Ropsy Nesbitt. I'm sure many of you have fond memories of this classic show. Ropsy Nesbitt is a timeless gem that has left indelible mark on television history. Join us as we relive the magic, revisiting those with the entire cast of then and now. We will explore the names and initial ages of the talented actors on the show and witness their transformation in 2024. So without further ado, let's dive into the world of Ropsy Nesbitt. Brian Pettifer was born in 1953 in the series he played Andra. In 1988, when he was in the sitcom, he was 35, and now he's 71. You know, there are times in my life when I've felt like the world's worst wee numpty jobby. And then I take a swatch at Big Rab and suddenly I'm walking in here. You know what I mean? It was a church scene that's no longer in it. Mm. And then and more months went past and my agent phoned me just before Christmas um, and said they want you to do the film. Tony Roper was born in 1941 in the series he plays James C. Goddard. In 1998, when he was in the sitcom, he was 47 years old, and now he's 82. He need a lad. I'm like a walking time bomb. I'm putting a man that messes with me. Haggis! <laughs> Ella. 60s, 70s. Uh, I was a labourer. I worked on the dockside. And my... The guy that I laboured to was a... Uh, Alex Norton was born in 1950 in the series he played Alec. In 1988, when he was in the sitcom, he was 38, and now he's 74. Ain't a fault if you want to end up back in the jug. Who knows, maybe you prefer their cooking, eh? Listen, it was my fault. Right, just let's leave it out. It's my fault. That's a spirit. Uh, because it, when I was a kid and used to go to the cinema, uh, Disney pictures were the big thing. They made the best. The best, the best. Gregor Fisher was born in 1953 in the series he played Rapsi Nesbitt. In 1988, when he was in the sitcom, he was 35, and now he's 70 years old. And the stupid faces, them is my animals. So let them go forth and never work and get plenty of nookie, you see? And that'll make up for them. It was always shot in the winter lashing rain and a string vest with your nipples at a 45 degree angle and they're painful you know it's that kind of ron donichi was born in 1956 in the series he played haget in 1990 when he was in the sitcom he was 34 and now he's 67. <laughs> he thinks the unwaged are feather bedded let him try living on social security benefit see how he likes it order just move you ever so slightly, you know, put you in, and, and when you see the picture, yeah, it, it's it's like all the painting, the, the, the work that they do. It's, it's a real privilege to be involved in it. Elaine C. Smith was born in 1958. In the series, she played Mary Nesbitt. In 1988, when she was in the sitcom, she was 30 years old, and now she's 65. Is it? Hey, where's my dinner hen? Is it in the micro? In the micro? You'll be bloody lucky. You are half an hour late, boy. Your dinner is in the rat. It was created. I think I knew at the time it was it was a really good episode. I knew when we, we read it, but it also came at the end of... It was it. Lee Corns was born in 1951 in the series he played DSS Clerk. In 1990, when he was in the sitcom, he was 39 years old, and now he's 73 work in that way. We must all pull our weight in life. Now then, here's a list of community enterprise vacancies. You ought to choose one now or for All the pulling and the stretching and so on. But I don't regret a minute of it. And of course I've still got lovely old actor here to keep me company. And you're a lovely boy, aren't you? You're an actor. Barbara Rafferty was born in 1950 in the series he played Alec Carter. In 1990, when she was in the sitcom, she was 40 years old, and now she's 74. You stand there and insult my wings. I think I'd better go, Mary. Before I say something I regret. Aye, aye, go on. No, I wouldn't say too much, but there's a, uh, there's a sort of correlation with Alzheimer's, I thought, and I found that really, really, really interesting. Norman Lovett was born in 1946 in the series he played Brother Gideon. In 1990, when he was in the sitcom, he was 44 years old, and now he's 77. 
I too was much in love with a woman that left me for another man. I always swore to revenge myself. And then I, I started doing gigs with punk bands and things before the alternative comedy came along and the comedy store. And that's when I sort of found this style that I... Nicola Park was born in 1972 in the series Play Pretty. In 1996, when she joined the sitcom, she was 24 and now she's 52. Is that your final word then? It's my body. It's a woman's right to choose. But you didn't choose pregnancy. Pregnancy. Ian McCall was born in 1954 in the series he played Dodie. In 1990, when he was in the sitcom, he was 36, and sadly he passed away on July 4th, 2013, at 59. Mia, she invited me to leave. <laughs> if you can't see the subtle distinction there, don't expect him to draw pictures. <laughs> Ian Cuthbertson was born in 1930 in the series he played Drunk Man. In 1988, when he was in the sitcom, he was 58, and sadly he passed away on September 4th, 2009, at 79. Nisbet. <laughs> a very shame, boss. She is all the very best. Silence. <laughs> You'll show this court respect. Um, James Aaron. Eric Collin was born in 1965. In the series, he plays Bernie Nesbitt. In 1988, when he was in the sitcom, he was 23 years old. And sadly, he passed away on August 16, 1996, at 31. Bernie son! Who is that strange man, Mammy? It's, it's me, it's your dad. I know it's you, you chud. <laughs> Don't you chud me! When we reflect on the incredible journey of Ralph C. Nesbitt that took place from 1988 to 2014, witnessing the growth and transformation, we can see that the connection from those years left a lasting legacy. Their story continues to resonate with fans around the world. And as always, show some love, hit the like button, subscribe for more, and hit the bell to never miss my new content.